can't believe this. It's gone! J.D. Martinez homers in four. Grand slam, their second of the game, and the Indians continue their win streak. They've won five in a row. Javier drives one in the air, deep right center field. Back goes Moncrief, still going, still going, still going. That ball's off the wall and bouncing away. Javier might round the bases. Hey. MLB Network's coverage of Major League Baseball is on the air. Opening day is here. The games count starting now. Opening day on MLB Network, and it's coming up next. A chance now to look at the batting order for the visiting Rangers. Mark, what do you have on this lineup as they go for their first win? Matt, do you take a look at this lineup? I find myself thinking back to my playing days. Tell yourself, even though you felt bad about it, just get two or three. All the pressure's on the big boy to have to execute, and he usually does. Look for this lineup to try and execute and score. Now here's the pitch. And the Rangers are in the hit column for the first time this year. No mistake what he was sitting on, looking for a dead red piece of cheese, middle of the plate, and he didn't miss it. There goes Elvis. That's a strike to throw down. And it skips in as he steals the bag easily. Here now the 2-2. Oh, and ouch, that would have drilled him. Unable to recover, he's safe at first, and now the attention turns back to the guy on the mound. High in the air down the right field line. Reddick has a read on it. He's there to make the catch, and here comes the runner from third, as this should get him on the board. And the run will score as the Rangers strike first to lead it 1 0. Here's Joey Gallo now. Last ball in the honey hole. I'm surprised he didn't pull the trigger on that one. Swing and a drive to right. There it goes. And goodbye. This one ain't coming back. Joey Gallo with a two run shot. Here's Nelson Cruz now. Swing and a long drive again. This one to deep center. Gone. Back to back homers. A solo home run from Nelson Cruz. That home run is definitely worth giving the show track treatment to. And as we look at it, not only an impressive distance shot, but the 110 miles an hour exit velocity is nothing to scoff at either. That's a big boy home run. Robinson Chirinos. Swung on and lifted in the air to left center. Hicks is under it. He's got it and there are two down now. Seven. Settling in now, Rugnet Odor. And right into the shift. And he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is... Time now for a quick look at the hometown Astros starting lineup. Nero, give us what you have on this lineup as they start a new series. Matty, this lineup finds himself in a hole right now. So that pass to baton mentality. Can't try and get it all back at once. Have good at bats. Follow the game plan you guys worked on, and stay in the zone. Michael Fulmer is on the mound. Who next is Josh Reddick as he gets ready in the on deck circle. Hit back up the middle. Base hit, and the Strohs are into the hit column for the first time this season. There's a hard hit ground ball. Pitcher not able to get a glove on it. Hard single up the middle. Yeah, watch your lips right there, Dad. Horton here on three and one to still make a quality pitch. You have to have and he goes the other way as this is hit high and deep out to straightaway left. Orlando is on the warning track as he hauls it in for a loud out number one. Next up for the Strohs, Carlos Correa Correa. beat it into the ground. Set the deal on a ball and two strikes. Pitch misses low. The throw down is not close. Oh, hitter. If he can work a walk or pick up a hit here, he's going to put that. There's a swing and a ball hit in the air and a ball that he got every stitch of as that one, without a doubt, is gone. Here's George Springer. 
A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. But that'll hit off the wall in left center. And he's in there easily at second with a one out double. One team's dream inning is another team's nightmare, right? That's their third hit of this opening inning. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Tavares moves over. Two gone. Now with the plate, Alex Bregman. Hit high in the air down the right field line. Mazzara's on his horse. He's got it. A great running play, and that'll retire the. And that'll bring up the burst offering on its way. Hit on the ground out to short. Correa comes up with it. Throw to first will be in time, and there's one gone here to start the second. Adding ninth, center fielder. Stepping in, Leo, Leo Tavares. Tavares. Swung on and hit deep to left center. This one has a chance. Gone! So a solo shot here to left center field. Here's Elvis Andrus now. High in the air out to center field. Springer on the run. And he brings it in for the second out of the inning. And now the power hitting outfield. Here's another one, too. There's a swing and a high drive into left center field. Hicks going back, still going back. It's up and out of here into the archway. A solo home run for Nomar Mazzara. It's 0-1. He hit a sack fly early. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Springer is right there, and he will make the catch, so that'll do it. Leading off the inning, Yuli Gurriel. And this one is we're still early on, but you don't want to fall too far behind. They're already down by a bundle, and one of the things you want your leadoff guy to get on and set the table for the big boys to start driving in some runs. Digging in the switch hitter, Aaron Hicks. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Hit out towards second. Backhanded. Throw gets him, two down. Now it's plate, Brian Holland. The 2 2. Popped him up. Andres onto the grass. He tracks it down, and that will end the inning. Digging into trouble. Ball and two strikes. Here's the pitch. Swing and a miss on the slider, and that's out number one. Here's Nelson Cruz. Looked like the cut fastball there, and he got him to swing through it for the second out. Digging in for his second out. If he can fare any better. High in the air and deep to straightaway left. Hicks going back at the track, but he can't get to this one. It's off the wall. And he'll make it to second base now with two gone. Well, he's certainly not shy, is he? He goes up there looking to be aggressive and takes a... The 2-1 home. Popped him up. Holiday has a play. And that's the third out. Back to the top of the order now. And Swing the ball line softly down the line and left. And that's a fair ball heading for the scoreboard near the Crawford boxes. The tag and he's nabbed trying for two. Striding in for Houston, Josh Reddick. That one. There's not a situation ever where you want to throw a high changeup, so I think he'll try to make an adjustment with the next one he throws. And that's going to be a base hit for Reddick. Well, that's got to be frustrating right there. You execute a pitch. Nice, good pitch right there. Batter's able to get it. Got him looking with the fastball as that had some two-seam movement to it. Two gone. So here's the Astros cleanup. He's set. Here it comes. Chopped weakly to the left. Here's a flip to Odor covering, and the inning is over. 
stepping in and ready. Many hitters are better against opposite handed arms of course but he's considered one of the best hitters in baseball in these types of matchups. Throw to first in time one gone here in the fourth. How about it? Riding in once again and the 3 1. Hit high and deep to right center. And he will run this one down. A good read off the bat for the He's one for two in this one. Now the one and one pitch. Line drive to center field. And that's in for his second hit of the afternoon. And the two out hit will bring Nomar Mazzara to the plate. Hey, they weren't going to keep this guy down for long. That's the ebbs and flows of the baseball season. Bottom line is this guy popped him up. Bregman is under it. And that ends the inning. So no runs. Here's Matt Adams. Swung on and missed. Really fooled him that time for the first out. And that'll bring up the former first. Ani pops it up. Odor onto the grass. Two gone. Striding forward now is the DA. To short. Throw to first will get him easily, and the side is retired. Jose Abreu. It's a swing and a high pop-up. Adams on the move. He gets to it and makes the catch for the first out. Hard hit towards center. Springer is there. Two gone. How about it? To the plate now for Texas is the D.A. Sent on the ground, but right into the shift. And the throw just does beat him at the bag, so the side is retired. Stepping into the box, Aaron Hicks. We'll He'll see if they can wake it back up. Hit hard on the ground a second. Odor has it. And there's one down now. So coming to the plate. Right. Wow, that's what they call it. Jam sandwich. Wow. Not much you can do with that pitch that's in tight. Fielded by a door. And there are two away now. So the Houston lineup turns thus far. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Back up the middle. And that's in there for a base hit. His third hit of the game. So he delivers with two away in the bottom of the fifth Order. line pitch at strike one. A hit in. Oh, he wants to get a swing and a miss on this next pitch. And he struck him out. A 10 pitch battle, but he finally. David Paulino takes over to start the sixth inning on the mound. Number 63. Into the box. Robert. Hit hard to short. Correa right there. Throw to first gets him, so the leadoff man's retired here to begin the sixth. How about Here's Rognet Odor now. Oh, for now a half swing, but it's strike three anyway, says the home plate umpire, and that's out number two. And Ronald Guzman will get the call to pitch. One and two. The count's now at two and two, but boy, that one very easily could have been called strike three. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away. Ronald Guzman will stay in the ball game now and take over in left field. Now playing left. Carlos Correa will stand in here, but before he does, let's take you back to the very first inning. This was a two-run. Smoked on the ground up the middle. The door towards second. He's got it. And the throw to first is in time. One gun. Here's George Springer. He's working on cut out for him against a great pitcher. But if he's going to locate like that, this is going to be a tough day. And he goes with the pitch here and drives it the other way to deep right. Mazzara is back to the warning track, and he's able to put it away for the second out. Here's the first pitch of the at-bat. And he turns this one around high and deep to center field. Tavares ranging back out of here to the deepest part of the yard. Spans just a little. It's 0 1.
line to the right side. That gets down and he's got himself a base hit. Hey, there's another base knock right there. A hitting streak now. Comes out from the bullpen now as he'll get the call here on opening day. Hit fairly well afterwards straight away center. Tavares coasts under it. No trouble with this one and the inning is over. Ready now, Leo. Now he spins on one here and drives it to deep right field. And it's gone as they add still another. A solo shot here to straightaway right field. To Sandris now. He swings and grounds it to short. And that's through for a hit. Hey, Dero, not a bad night. Three singles, but hey, you'll take three from four every day of the week. Yeah, in today's day and age, Dan, where everything's a home or a walk or a strikeout, it's refreshing to see this guy. The one and two pitch. And this one gets away. Go either way. The three two pitch. Now he tries to hold back on the swing, and the home plate umpire says he did so successfully. Mm, it's ball four. Pull the trigger on a fastball middle in. That's why you play. You get in those situations where you can try and do damage. What do you want, the nasty slider? On to first to complete the double play. So here's the cleanup pitcher. Three-two pitch. Gallo swings, and this one is crushed out to right field. Gone into the upper deck. So a two run homer down the line in right field. Here's Nelson Cruz now. Grounded to short. Throw in time and the side is retired. Riding in, Aaron Hick. Comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch to third. And the throws off line as he tried to sweep it up that time, but came up with nothing but a glove full of dust. Now Stepping up to the plate, Brian. Swung on and lifted in the air to left center. Tavares is after it. And he tracks it down. Nice play for the first down. Here's the second baseman, Jose. From the stretch. Lifted in the air to center field. Tavares is there to put it away, and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. So digging in now. Better come up fastball at this level. You cannot be late right there. That was right in the wheelhouse. Lifted in the air to shallow center field. Tavares coming on. And that retires the side. One left for you. Digging in. Robinson. In the zone and let it break out of the zone where it can't be punished. Didn't get him to go after it. Oh, what a stop on the slide. It's there. He got him. Hitless in three at-bats to this point. Ready with the nothing in one pitch. Swung on and driven to right. And no doubt about it. And this ball is gone. No chance to make a play. It's a solo shot here for Rugnit Odor. Hit it hard but lined out in his first game. And the pitch. Now that ball is smoked. Carrying to deep left. Not quite out of here. It's off the out-of-town scoreboard. And this will wind up a closer play than I thought, but he's in there with two bases. This right here is the difference between an average hitter and a fifth. And a half-hearted attempt that time, but they'll say he broke the plane, and that's out number two. So the lineup flips up. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. And look out as that fastball ran in and got him. Ouch, Brand. In now the. From the belt, the pitch. Pulled toward right center field. Springer giving chase. He's got it. A great running play, and that'll retire the side. 
So the Rangers add on thanks to this solo home run. Phil Maton is out from the bullpen now as he'll make his first appearance here on the season. This is in that location unless they're looking for it. Shot to third. And there's one away. Now So now it'll be the four hole. Hit in the air down the right field line. Mazar is under it. Two down. Trying to pick things up where we left. The 0 2 pitch. And he turns on one, sending it high and deep to right. And that one is gone on a two strike go count. right down the pipe as we near the end of this. We saw that here this afternoon, a ball flying out at near record pace. And the throw is in time. It's a strikeout, and the play at first goes two to three. Now in the box. Now a check swing here, and no swing, says the home plate umpire. Not even an appeal. It's ball four. Joey Gallo will get another shot at it here as we take you back to inning number seven. This was his second. Juan Santos will be summoned now to be the pinch. From the belt, kicks and deals. Popped him up. Under it is Altuve, and he's got it for the first down. Here's Nelson Cruz now. In the dirt, and now let's see. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Springer on the run. He gets there and makes the play for the second out of the inning. Into the box now. Robin guessing. Now the three and two pitch is three. in there. A called strike three. Your Juan Santos will stay in the ball game as he'll take over at first base. Ron Dyson is into the ball game now as he'll. The one one. Hit the other way out toward right field. Mazar is under it. He's got it one away. Coming to the plate now. And that is swung on and missed. And things are starting to look bleak here for the home nine. There are two away now. Last strike now for Houston. Now a swing and a ground ball. This should do it. Pro will be in time to get him at first base. And the Rangers. Move to 1 0 on the young season as this ball game is over. 10 to 4, the final in this game. Texas brought their big the bats to the park in this one, hammering seven home runs. Michael Fulmer. Inside the show with Justin.